Okay, our class today mostly will be about still on the topic of limit. But for this case is for lim the function of x approaching infinity. Okay, just a few examples first. That's our introduction. Okay, uh, 1 over 1 is how much? 1. 2 over 2? 1. 5 over 5? That's the basics. Okay, the advanced method of this will be, what about 1 over x over 1 over x? Okay, what about 1 over x squared, 1 over x squared? Okay, advance of that will be 1 over x over 1 over x squared, square root. Are you sure, one? This thing here, after we simplify, after we square root it, 1 over x, right? 1 over x, 1 over x, still 1. Same thing goes for what happened if I do 1 over x squared, square root, 1 over x. 1. What about... 1 over x squared, 1 over x squared, square root, square root, 1. Okay, don't blame me if you get confused later. <laughs> this thing, okay? That I have, sir. Now, what about if... <coughs> what about if uh, 1 over infinity? Sorry? 1 over infinity. Am I 1 over infinity? 2 over infinity? Zero. 1 billion over infinity? Zero. Things are easy. Okay, next things is what about Let's take this one first. What is denominator highest power? X highest power. One and what about if I give you Denominator highest power? One and not this x squared. Denominator. And what about if I give you something like this? Denominator highest power? One or two? One. Because x squared square root? One. Highest degrees lah. Okay, so now let's try to combine all of those basics. Let's start with something simple. Okay, what's the denominator highest power? One, right? Highest degree. Okay, because it's power one, dengan lelok class, this, this, this is very important. Because the highest degree here is one, we multiply with one over x, one over x. Okay? 
Okay. And then, what happens if 1 multiplied with 1 over x? What happens if here is 1 over x? 1 over x. One okay, this thing here, you need to do the rainbow. 1 with 1 over x. 1 over x. Now, negative x with 1 over x. 1. Are you okay this far? Uh, ignore the infinity first. We, we don't use the infinity yet. Right now, I'm just multiplying inside. Okay? We, we haven't used the infinity yet. We haven't used the infinity stone yet. X approaching infinity. Yes. Yeah. Okay, so... When you see x approaching infinity, you should multiply with this one first. Okay, now, until here, are you guys okay? Okay, now we substitute, but we, we don't write down infinity over there. Because, technically, there's, there's no infinity. You, you cannot write down 1 over infinity. So, it's just mentally on your, in your head. Huh? So, 1 over infinity is what? 1 over infinity is 0. 1 over infinity? 0. Minus 1. Should I still write down lim? No. No more because we have substitute. So now we got here 0 over 0 minus 1, 0 over negative 1. Is this max error? No, it's pure 0. Are you okay? This is the basics of all. So let's try another example. What about... See the same, x approaching infinity. Sorry, to x. Okay, we don't care about the numerator. We only care about the denominator. What's denominator highest power? Squared lah. Because of that, we are multiplying with 1 over x squared. 1 over x squared. Okay, what power are you going to multiply this with in response of your deno denominator highest power? Actually, highest degrees. But of course, it's a lot easier to see highest power. Okay, so x over x squared. 1 over x. Negative 2 over 1 over x squared. Negative over x squared. x squared over x squared. 1. 2x. x squared over x squared. Oh, so sorry, I missed my 2. Thank you, thank you x squared, x squared, 1, 2, x over x squared. Are you okay? Do you want me to repeat them again? Raise your hand. Okay, 1 over x squared. There's still Uncle Lim. Okay, once we have reached this far, we substitute the x approaching infinity. So, 1 over x is? 0. Sorry, 1 over infinity. 2 over infinity square. Still 0. 1. 2 over infinity. 0. 0. So 0 over 1, 0. My goodness. Sorry. No casualty. <laughs> okay, my phone still okay. It's not broken yet. 
So let's move on. <coughs> Hampir terus penting. <laughs> okay. Now what about this? Uh, sorry, X approaching positive infinity. Some some lecturers they insist that you need you need to write down positive. Some. Okay, eight X. X squared minus nine square root. Okay, what's the denominator highest power? One or two? Yeah, one. So I should multiply with what? 1 over x 1 over x Okay, let's start on Okay, okay. Uh, right now, the highest power is 1 You okay with that? Because I square square root, right? Okay, but right now, look carefully Look carefully This one is okay, we have no problem I need to have square root over here so if I square root over here, I need to square it back. Square square root. Okay, we have talked just now. Are this equal? We have talked about it just now. Lengthy. I don't remember where I keep it. Oh well. We have talked lengthy just now that they are equals to one. Until here, you guys okay? Sure, tak faham angkat tangan? Raise your hand if you want me to explain again. Okay, uh, since... Okay, this one, what's the highest power? Denom denominator highest power. One, right? Okay, so we just now, we, are, we start with multiplying. One over x. One over x. Okay? Because to respond with this denominator highest power. Yeah, you, you're okay with this, right? But this one here, we have square root. So I need to square root it. But I cannot just do that because if I do that, then they are no longer equal. How do I make them equal? I put a square over here. Okay, and these are still equal. You okay with it? Do you want me to explain again? Thank you. So we got this far. So now we try to multiply them. One, so we still the Uncle Lim over there. I'm sorry. Eight x over x. Eight x over x. Still an eight. One over one over x. Are you okay that far? Now this one got square root. So x squared over x squared. 1 minus 9 over x squared minus 9 over x squared Are you okay? Are you okay this far? So now we substitute the x approaching infinity So 8 Plus 1 over infinity? Zero. 0. Square root? 1. Minus? 0. So what do we get? 8 over 1. 8 over 1. 8. Are you okay? You want me to explain again? Okay, why don't you try this one? Let me give you something to try.
Question from 2006. Yeah, both of them 2006. X squared minus 2. 3x plus 6. Yeah, the answer is in the in the sheet, but please do not look at it yet. Try it by your own first. Kalau tengok, then you don't learn anything lah. What's the use? And let's throw one complex question. What do you think of this one? Okay, good luck. Readers, give it a try. Yeah, this one here, you should get 1 over 3. Do you want me to show you? Or are you okay? Show. Sure. Sure. Ah, yeah, I cannot skip. Ah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, okay. So, how, how do we start? What's the denominator highest power? So, you multiply with? 1 over x. 1 over x, sorry I'll be a bit fast on this case. So lim. But up here there's a square root, right? And square, so what should we do? Square root, square, are you okay? You, you want me to explain this one? Okay, right? Because there's square root, square, square root lah. So what do you get for denominator? 3x over x, 3, 6 over x, 6 over x lah. Now what about up here, x squared over x squared, negative 2 over x squared. So now you substitute, 1 minus 2 over infinity, 0, 3 plus 6 over infinity, 0. And give you 1 over 3. You guys okay? Yes. Okay, what about this one? I should multiply with what? 1 over x squared. Why? Why not 1 over x4? Denominator highest power is 2. Okay? But up here, there's square root, right? So what should I do? I should square root 8. And then, x squared, power squared, what do I get? x4. Are you okay? Do you want me to explain again? If you want me to explain again this one, please raise your hand. Okay, so what do I get for the bottom? x squared over x squared. 1. 6 over x squared. And what about up here? 3x4 over x4. x over x4. x over x4. 1 over x cubed. Are you okay? Do you want me to explain again? Please raise your hand. Okay, now we substitute. 1, 0, 3, plus 0, square root. Set 3. Are you okay? Yes? Which one? Because there's square root here. If there's, if there's square root here, I need to square and square root again. Then it, then it becomes equal. Uh, it depends which part of the square root. Lah. Kalau well, denominator have square root, then you have to do square and square root denominator. And, and like for these two cases, both of them are up. Bawah, bawah lah. Yes, you are right. If bottom, bottom lah. You okay? Are you okay this far? Do you want me to explain again? 
Okay, this one is a bit tough. What's denominator highest power? What's denominator highest power? It's not one. I mean, if if there's squared and square root, then I understand it's one. Can if I if I square root this, what do I get? One over two lah. I mean, still. So that means denominator highest power for this case is not one, but this itself. You guys okay? So this it means here the square root comes naturally. It needs to be there. So if this is the denominator highest power, so what will the numerator be? Same as it is. If not, there will not be balance. Are you okay? So now we multiply them inside. Set x over, I mean, x over x. One, set one, yeah, you can say that. So this one, x over square root x. And then x over x. I mean, uh, uh, if you if you get confused this part, you can do it this way. You can square root it, then multiply it one by one. X plus one over x over x plus. Some people might not be able to do mentally at this point. Are you okay? Do you want me to repeat this one again? So x over x. 1 plus 1 over x plus 1. Now we replace our limb. 1 plus 0 plus 1 square root. 1. At this point here, you just got 1 plus 1 over 1 just means 2. If I'm not mistaken. Are you okay? Do you want me to repeat them again? Please raise your hand. Yeah, very good if you got that far. Okay, ready? We're going for far more advanced. At this point here, you guys okay? Yeah. 